dances in India. The contemporary Indian classical dance forms, which are governed by elaborate technique and stylized system of both pure movement and mime have had their origin in the dances of the common people. Five dance styles are known as classical or art dance on account of a sophisticated degree of stylization. The history of these forms can be traced backward beyond 200, sometimes 300 years. Each has a link with the literature, sculptural and musical traditions of the ancient and medieval period of India and the particular region. They all adhere to the principles enunciated by Bharata, namely of the division of dance into Nritta, pure of abstract dance, Nritya, dance with mime, of Tandava and Lazia of stylized presentation, Natyadami. However, the technique of movement is distinctive, with a definite stylization. Each follows a different set of rules for the articulation of movement. Bharatnatyam Bharatnatyam developed in South India particularly in Tamil Nadu in its present form about 200 years ago. While its poses are reminiscent of sculptures of the 10th century onwards, the thematic and musical content was given to it by the musicians of Tanjore courts of the 18th and 19th centuries. It is essentially a solo dance and had close affinities with the traditional dance drama form called Bhagavata Mela performed only by women. Nonetheless, its chiseled sophistication and stylization make it a unique form of art dance. Kathakli Kathakli from Kerala is classical dance drama. Unlike the others, it is dramatic rather than narrative in character. Different roles are taken by different characters. The dancers are all men or were so, till recently. It takes epic mythological themes as its contents and portrays them through an elaborate dramatic spectacle which is characterized by an otherworldly quality, a supernatural grandeur, a stylized large-size costume to give the impression of enlarging human proportions, and a mask-like makeup on the face which is governed by complex symbolism of color, line and design. Character types, such as heroes, anti-heroes, villains, demons, sages, kings, all have a prescribed makeup and costume to give the impression of collating basic. For example green with good, red with valor and ferocity, black with evil or primitiveness, white with purity, and so on. Why is Kathakli not a drama? Within the framework of drama with dramatic personage, Kathakli is dance drama and not drama because the actors do not speak their lines. The dramatic story is carried forward through a highly evolved vocabulary of body movements, hand gestures and eye and eyeball movements. The vocalist recites, narrates, and sings the lines of the dramatic piece. The actor on the stage portrays the meaning through this elaborate language where he has freedom to improvise and interpret the dramatic line. He makes departures and deviations freely like the dancer of any other styles. Also like the dancers of the other styles, the mime, Abhinaya, is interspersed with pure dance sequences, Nrita. Kuchipudi. It is a form of classical dance popular in Andhra Pradesh. It was a dance drama performed by the Brahmins in the temple. It was confined to males. Sai Hendra Yogi, in the 14th century revived this form of dance. He composed the Bhama Kalpam. 
The efforts of Lakshmi Naran Shastri and Vedantam Satya Naran resulted in bringing in females to participate in this dance form. Carnatic music forms the background in this dance. The dance has lazia and tandaf elements and is a mixture of folk and classical from a flute, flute, violin, manjaras are being used in this dance. The main modern exponents of this dance are Raja and Radharedi, Chinta Krishnamati, Yemani Krishnamurati, Swapna Sundari, Shobanaidu, Pashumati, etc. A famous aspect of the dance is that the dance is performed with the feet kept on brass plate. And also dancers drawing pictures on the floor with their toes. Mohanyatam Mohanyatam is one of the distinctive classical dance styles of India. It originated in Kerala and the movements of Mohanyatam. Evoke in one's mind the ethereal splendor of Kerala with its lush venture, lagoons, the purple hills, and a land kissed by the foams of turquoise sea waters. This form had almost become extinct when it was revived by poet Valath Olinara Yana Menon in early 19th century. Since then, dancers have striven to reclaim the lost repertoire of Moinyatam. The main features of Mohinyatam are its exquisite feminine charm and its graceful swaying movements. It is a solo dance performed by women only. Kathak Kathak, from North India, is an urban sophisticated style full of virtuosity and intricate craftsmanship. Commonly identified with the court traditions of the later Nawabs of Northern India, it is really an amalgam of several folk traditions. Its origins are old, its present format new, attributed to the genius of Nawab Wajid Ali Shah and the hereditary musical dancer, Pandit Thakur Prasaji. The contemporary repertoire was evolved by a few families of traditional dancers. During the last hundred years, Bo Maharaj is the greatest living exponent of this dance form. Manipuri Manipuri is a lyrical dance form from the eastern region of India. Although many forms of ritual, magical, community and religious dance were known to Manipur before the advent of Vishnivu faith in the 18th century, the dances known as the Raza dances evolved only as a result of the interaction of the Vishnava faith. The origin of the Raza dances is attributed to the vision of a king. Be that as it may, five different types of ballets, with a well-conceived structuring of corps de ballet, solo pas de deux revolving round the theme of Radha Krishna and the gopis, milkmaids comprise the large part of the classical repertoire. The second group of the classical dances is known as the Sankritanas, performed generally by men with typical Manipur drums called pung or cymbals, kartals, or clapping. At large variety of intricate rhythmic patterns is played on the drum and the cymbals. The Nadis in Kritana often precedes the Rasa. Adisi. Adisi is a close parallel of Bharat Natyam. It developed from the musical play and the dances of gymnasiums known as the Akaras. Sculptural evidence relating to the dance goes to the 2nd century BC. From the 12th century onwards there are inscriptions or manuscripts and other records which speak of the prevalence of dance styles of ritual dances of temples and entertainments of the village squares. A 12th century poetic work called Gita Govinda has dominated the poetic and musical content of the dance styles. The dance was performed by women called Maharis in the temple of Jagannath. Later, men dressed as women, called Gotiparas, performed these dances in the courtyard of the temple.
the present Odyssey is a solo form evolved out of all the above. It has been revived during the last two decades. Sunil Mansingh is the greatest living exponent of this dance form.